When your business is operating on a global scale or stateside with the help of global imports, you want every advantage you can get. That's why when you want your ship to come in, you should have your imported cargo come to Delaware. Imported goods come into Delaware through our ideally located Port of Wilmington, the hub of the statewide Delaware Foreign Trade Zone, offering companies a wide range of financial and logistical benefits. When you receive imported goods to Delaware's Foreign Trade Zone, the state of Delaware delivers a competitive edge for your company. A foreign trade zone is an area in the United States that the government considers to be outside the U.S. for duty and tax purposes. This brings immediate benefits for U.S. companies importing goods. That's because products that enter the country through a foreign trade zone do not go through the formal customs entry process. Import duties and taxes aren't due until goods exit the foreign trade zone. So, importing goods to a foreign trade zone lets you defer, reduce, or even eliminate the duties and excise taxes you would otherwise have to pay. Goods you import to the U.S. outside a foreign trade zone are subject to duties. This, of course, increases your costs and reduces your profits. You can keep merchandise in a foreign trade zone as long as you like, and because duties and federal excise tax are deferred on merchandise until it leaves the foreign trade zone, you can potentially defer these costs for a considerable amount of time. This gives a valuable boost to your cash flow, but that's far from all. Your company gets even more tax benefits with a foreign trade zone. Certain property is exempt from state and local ad valorem taxes while in the zone. Ad valorem tax is a fee based on the value of your inventory. That means items you keep in your foreign trade zone warehouse, like parts you've imported from other countries to use in your manufacturing process, are not taxed until you actually sell and ship your product. Even then, your company doesn't face the rates you otherwise would on the individual foreign imports. That's because the foreign trade zones bring you relief from inverted tariffs. Wait, inverted tariffs? Let's discuss that. Say you're manufacturing products in the U.S. using parts you've imported. The parts are subject to tariffs at various rates. The individual parts often face a higher tariff rate than the tariff owed on the final product. This puts U.S. companies in a disadvantage to importers and it can drive U.S. companies to move their manufacturing to other countries. That's where a foreign trade zone comes in. If you manufacture in a foreign trade zone, you may avoid paying the rate on the individual parts you pay the rate that applies to the assembled product as low as 2%. An added bonus, goods exported from the foreign trade zone owe no customs duty or excise tax. There's another big way that a foreign trade zone can cut your costs every week. With few exceptions designed to create jobs and grow the U.S. economy, U.S. Customs and Border Protection typically charges a merchandise processing fee on every foreign shipment received in the U.S. The fee is based on the value of the imported goods and as of October 2022, it can be as high as $575 for each shipment. When you import to a foreign trade zone, you pay the fee just once a week, regardless of the value of the goods and the frequency of the shipments. The savings add up quickly. For example, if your company receives 10 shipments per week, each with an estimated maximum merchandise processing fee of $575 on each shipment, that's $5,750 per week. Over the course of a year, you owe $299,000 in merchandise processing fees. If you could remove the merchandise processing fee per shipment and make it a weekly cost of $575, you would owe just $29,900 per year through the benefits of a foreign trade zone. This example would be a savings of $269,100 every year. A foreign trade zone cuts your costs at many steps throughout the process. Wondering exactly what your company can do in a foreign trade zone? Well, you can assemble, display, destroy, manufacture, relabel, repackage, repair, store, and test your products on site. A foreign trade zone provides a safe, secure location for your business to conduct its ongoing operations. A foreign trade zone serves as a zone that truly promotes global trade for U.S. companies by offering a number of cost-saving and time-saving benefits. Cities and states with foreign trade zones in turn see local economic growth in their regions as a result of the expanded facilities and jobs they create, so they are a win-win across the board. For all of these reasons, Delaware is proud to support companies as a foreign trade zone. Now that you know more about foreign trade zones, why should you go with Delaware's FTZ 99? 
there are several reasons to make the first state's foreign trade zone your first choice. The Port of Wilmington in Delaware is ideally situated for commerce. Located in the heart of the East Coast's bustling Mid-Atlantic region between New York City and Washington, D.C. In fact, New York City, Washington, D.C., Philadelphia, and Baltimore are all within a 125-mile radius and eight international airports are within 150 miles. Wilmington is a stop on multiple passenger and freight lines and it offers easy access to I-95, the interstate that runs the entire East Coast from Florida to Canada. If you're looking for access to air, land, and sea, Delaware is your best option. Besides its convenience, Delaware has been a hub for American business for years. More than half of all publicly traded U.S. companies and more than 66% of Fortune 500 companies are incorporated in Delaware. The state's low corporate taxes attract many businesses and allow them to operate successfully. Delaware taxes are appealing to employees, too, as there is no sales tax and property taxes are reasonable for the region. Need more on the benefits of Delaware's foreign trade zone? The Port of Wilmington houses the largest dockside refrigerated complex in North America with 800,000 square feet of cold storage, making it the leading U.S. port for fresh fruit. The next time you eat a banana, think of the Port of Wilmington because your banana probably came through the port's doors. The Port of Wilmington offers 250,000 square feet of dry covered cargo warehouse space as well. Its exceptional inventory control and security measures protect against theft. If your company is importing to the United States, take advantage of every opportunity you can to operate efficiently and effectively. Choose Delaware's foreign trade zone number 99 to cut costs, cut red tape, and improve efficiency. Connect with Delaware to connect with the world.